That's a good one. Is that is that Splat? This one is Splat and Ethan. Yeah. Like, and you have Meridian. I got Meridian. Yeah. I need I need one. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they're they're awesome shirts, man. Yeah, cust, custom merch that yeah. we yeah, our that team we made in yeah. studio for us. Yeah, yeah. I would hope you got them for free as you made the thing. Yeah. Well, Don yeah. paid for them, so it was, oh, it was, it was, it was on, yeah, <laughs> on his check. Uh, guys, congratulations <laughs> on the film. Thank you. Oh. Uh, it's been a bit of a week of childhood memories for me because mm. earlier in the week I spoke to the cast of Willow, which is a big thing in my right, house. Right, oh, right, right. I went yeah. to see this film and I was like. Have they just made a new version of Inner Space? Because it feels like <laughs> it felt like very, very Inner Spacey. And obviously then Dennis Quaid did it as well. Mm, so that yeah. gave me some good vibes. Am I misreading it? Or is there a little note of Inner Space in this one? Maybe it's just me because I'm such a huge fan of the film. It wasn't necessarily intentional. I mean, the, you know, the... The the, go, the the movie was always about going inside, you know, journey to the center of the earth and then, you know, going inside of a, a, a living thing. Um, but the inner space of it all was just sort of a cute coincidence. Uh, yeah. Because, you know, obviously when we cast Dennis, we knew that and thought it, would, thought it was enjoyable. Yeah. Did he know that? Um... Well, he, he, I mean, he knew the story at yeah. get-go. Like, when yeah. we pitched it to him, like, he knew where we were going. I think he did make a joke. He's like, oh, you know I've done it. It's like, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, of course we know. We're familiar <laughs> with your work, Mr. Yeah, Quaid. Yeah, yeah, you're, <laughs> you're not like some nobody. <laughs> so. um, obviously, I know and for you guys as, as animators and as filmmakers, it gives you such a plethora of ideas and things to do. With this one particularly, there's so much going on. I know it always takes a long time. So how long did this one take to, to come to fruition this time around? Um... Well, we had a, a different journey on this film because we started in 2018 is when Quee came on. Yeah. We worked for about a year, and then I, um, I went on to Raya and the Last Dragon to direct that, and I pulled him with me to write it. And so we did that for, what, about a year and a half or so, and yeah. then came back onto this one. Um, and um, so, you know, essentially, it, it, I, the, the, the genesis for the idea of this started in 2017. When, uh, I, when I came off of Moana, so. Uh, but yeah, again, it took a kind of a, a roundabout way to get there. And in terms of, uh, obviously, post-pandemic, I mean, animation, as with most films, it's been, it's been a difficult, difficult journey, and, and obviously theatrical and streaming and all that kind of stuff. Do you guys ever, do you think there's, a, there's, there's still, a, animation is such a big thing. Do you, do you see the benefits, at the positives and the negatives with, with streaming and theatrical for animation now as, as filmmakers? Well, absolutely. I think, you know, you, you, with with more places to do work, there's more opportunities for artists to be able to tell their stories and, you know, which, you know, more, more opportunities means more stories to be told, which is always great for, you know, for the audience. Uh, of course, when we're making, a, you know, a big Disney animated feature like this one, you know, we, we desperately would love for people to see it in the cinema, mainly because that's what we grew up doing. Like, our, you know, the dream uh, was us was little boys sitting in movie theaters making films that we, you know, that's what we wanted to do when we grew up. So like it was very much like uh, for us, the goal is to, to have people come to Strange World and, and experience it on the biggest screen possible. Yeah, and it's uh, I I saw the awesome new hundred year Disney uh, oh, yeah. opening, which yeah, is just yeah. fantastic, and it was just it just baffles my brain. It's been that long, and there's been so much in between. For you guys, what when you were kids, what was the kind of Disney thing that, that got you excited into being animal? Because there's just there's so much that you could choose from, whether you were a kid or also when you were an adult, there's so yeah, much Yeah, yeah. Well, I mean, from. for me, like, it, it's, it's sort of, it's hard to imagine, because this has always been my dream, is to, to work at Disney. So I, I, it's hard to imagine not <laughs> uh, being part of that or thinking about it. But, um, and when I was a kid, I mean, this was even pre-video. Mm. So they, you know, it was about whatever they were releasing every seven years, you know, and I do remember, you know, watching, you know, Dumbo, Bambi, you know, Peter Pan, Pinocchio, um, and those are foundational films to me. I saw them at a really young age in the theater, and it kind of set me on this path. There's so much, isn't there? But like, like you say, when I was a kid, it was VHS. I saw a, VH, a, yeah. a, a dodgy VHS copy of The Jungle yeah. Book, and even that was just like, <laughs> wow, I can't believe it's been... A uh, hundred years, and just finally on on Strange World. Obviously, there's so much going on. What are you hoping audiences kind of 
take away from this? Because there is there's so much stuff, and you guys have done so many things and, and pushed quite a few boundaries in this as well. Yeah, I mean, ultimately, it's it's a it's a story about the environment, right? Like our personal relationship and how we can uh, be better custodians of the planet that we live on. That how are we going to be good ancestors for future future generations? It's ultimately a a great adventure film. We want it to be something that you watch over and over again with your families. Uh, but like, if it, it can catalyst the conversation with your parents or with your families about you know our relationship with the world. I think that that's a good thing. Yeah. Fantastic, guys. I wish you all the best for the film. Thank Thanks you so much. Your so time. much. Pleasure. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Hey You Guys. Hey You Guys, huh? Hey you guys, Is yeah. that from the Goonies? It is indeed, yeah. Nice.